Cole Hamels hoping that that defense will be steady behind him tonight as he winds up for his sixth start of the season. 2-2 two -two pitch and a swing and a miss. Hamels, it's a very big strikeout. And records his first out of the night. Better so far this year. Swing and a miss. And he strikes out Chapman. For Andrew Triggs, his fastball generally is a sinker, a two-seam fastball with a lot of movement on it and in basically an equal amount of curveballs and sliders. The Rangers saw Trevor Cahill last night. There's the sweeping breaking ball. And Triggs gets him to chase that one in the dirt. So, wow, back-to-back -back strikeouts for Andrew Triggs. And the 3-2 pitch. Bounced left side in the hole. Covered up by Simeon. Throws across his body, not in time. And Mazzara beats out an infield hit. Well, there's the call. Yeah, we'll, to be continued, Dave. Yeah, yeah we'll, we'll get into that a little bit later. Mazzara grounds out. The inning is done. Starting to pile up here again in the second. This one lined to third. Beltre has it. <laughs> and juggles it a little bit. But that is an out. <laughs> Lost it on the exchange. But that, that was pretty good. Got about like six touches on that. Simeon bounces it left side. Nice snag by Beltre, and that will end the inning. On one pitch to Profar, fouled away, and it's not strike to, two. Not to mention the performance on the field. Now Beltre taking off to second base as the throw gets away from the pitcher, and now he'll head to third. Wow! I mean, nobody paying attention. And Beltre just keeps running. We're going to send him back, though, I think. With, with Beltre, you do always see it. He is always having fun as Profar strikes out swinging. Strike three called. Guzman down looking to start the third inning. 0-2. Ooh, a swing and a miss. So back-to-back -back strikeouts. That's five tonight. Ninth pitch of this at bat. And a bouncer by the mound to second. Kiner Falefa, tough bounce, but he throws out Kenna. Piscotti lines it to third. Beltre there to make the leaping grab two away. Ooh, strike three called. Mazzara down looking. Close pitch. And another strikeout, sixth of the night for Trey. No, I don't think I've ever enjoyed watching a player play for the Rangers more than Adrian Beltre. It'd be hard to. Bounces into a 5-4-3 double play. And that ends whatever threat the Rangers thought they may have had in the fourth. Four scoreless innings in the books. Yo, two. And a swing and a miss. Hey, look, Cole, Cole reacts to it. He I knows, got him. He knows exactly what Pinder's done against him. Sometimes people say, I wonder if the pitcher knows that. Of course he knows it. He knows exactly what Pinder's done every time. It's seven for seven, a single, three doubles, and three home runs. Watch him. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Generally, you don't react like that to the second out of the fifth inning. And he would basically an impossible out, and he swings and misses here, strikes out. Two in the fifth, so Hamels with four strikeouts, including two in the inning. Marcana, fly ball out to right field. Mazzara racing back to the wall, and in and out of his glove. That is a home run. Wow, I thought he caught it. Mm. And Canna has started the scoring tonight. His third home run of the year. Oakland leads one to nothing. Boy, that did not look like a home run coming off the bat. Rangers no runs on three hits. The 0-2 pitch. Swing and a miss. Strike three. Well, DeShields with a butt first base side, and there's no <laughs> chance with that one. Butt single for DeShields. The Rangers, though, have been aggressive running against him. That one comes inside and gets Chew. Yeah. Up high. That one gets away from Lucroy and both runners will move up. So now the Shields at third to the potential go ahead run in scoring position on what I don't know. I don't know it'll be a wild pitch. The 2 1. High fly ball. Canna over. So is Piscotti from right. He gets in a good position. Delano tags. He heads to the plate. He'll score easily. 
And with the throw coming through, it allows Chu to get to third base. And who knows, that might be a big play. And he hits ball on the ground, right side. But Lowry is there, and that ends the inning. And he's throwing the ball really well right now. Fly ball out to right. Whoa, a little miscommunication into Shields. Dropped it. And heading all the way to third is Jonathan Lucroy. The throw. Got him! Wow. Are you kidding me? You can see Delano yelling for it. And that was probably an easier play for Mazzara in right field. Looks like there'll be no appeal. But Kiner Falefa with a nice throw and a beautiful pickup by Adrian. Adrian, I think, took a spike to the back of his calf. You're right there. Jeez. Wow, that's some kind of play. This ball hit well down the left field line. Gallo on the run, and he'll have to take it on the carom. And so Simeon has a one-out double. Well, how big is that throw to third base now as Bush comes on? And you can see fastball, curveball, slider for Matt Bush. Shoots this one, though, in the air. And DeShields has to angle back, and it goes over his head. That's trouble. Simeon scores. Joyce will be stopped around third. Oakland back in front. It's two to one on the Lowry double. Well, Lowry just has that solid gap power. Here's a two one. And Davis hits it sharply on the ground. Profar gathers it on one hop. Jake Diekman on to start the eighth inning for the Rangers. He features a fastball in the mid 90s. Throws it 64 percent of the time. And 3-1. And there's ball four. So Chapman walks. Their offense going forward. This one lifted out to left field. Hanging up there a bit. Gallo going back. Looks up. And that one is off the scoreboard. Around third base. Chapman. He'll score. No throw offered. Olsen drives him in with that booming double. And it's 3-1 Oakland. 2-1 pitch. Ground ball. Shortstop. Profar is there. Underhands it to second. And the inning is done. And last year. Oh, and he wow. takes a liner right off the leg, and it bounces over to first. Two slides under the tag. Rolls over, and he is safe. Let's see what he did at Nashville. Pretty good. Torino's 3-2. This one out to the power alley. Right center field. That one's going to get down and roll to the wall. Two should score easily. Beltre stopped at first. And be something wrong. That doesn't look good. It's a 3-2 game. Right out of the batter's box. Looked like a leg injury. What an at-bat for Adrian. Guy's never seen the guy before. He's throwing 98 miles an hour. Swinging again and comes up empty. And that strikeout ends the Rangers' threat. Santiago Casilla has come on here. First save spot for him. Guzman sends this one out to left field. Chases Joyce back a little ways, but Joyce is there. And the inning is done, and the Rangers can't mount that comeback in the ninth inning and fall just short tonight. 3-2, our final score. Mm. So the frustrations continue for the Rangers.